Yo, what is going on YouTube? What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys for tuning in with me here today, man. Today we're diving into some Simon and Garfunkel America slash Homeward Bound. All right, so I'm still learning about Simon and Garfunkel. You're going to see this reaction before my next reaction on my YouTube video. So um, the, the reaction I've actually have recorded before this one is a Simon and Garfunkel Cecilia. If you're part of my Patreon, you've already seen that reaction. It's coming out later on this channel, maybe two weeks or so from now. Um, that you're watching this but this was a donation request so i'm getting to it first as i do with all my donation requests push them to the front of the line man we've got simon and garfunkel right here america slash homeward bound live in 1993 so this is the first time i get to see them live uh, but i do have at least one other live performance if not two of them lined up that i will get to at some point i'll react to those so we've got this one as a donation request thank you so much for supporting the channel this way man we got this one saying hi sean i'd love for you to hear simon and garfunkel performing america and homeward bound in concert in america i feel like i'm on the bus he's singing about homeward bound has my favorite harmony of all their songs i hope you like it yo appreciate it andrea let's go ahead and dive into this one Check it out. We got about six minutes, 22 seconds of live concert footage here, man. So this is going to be dope to get into. Let's, let's go ahead and hit that play, man. Thank you guys for rocking with me once again. Before I hit that play, don't forget if you guys are enjoying the channel myself, man, like, subscribe, check out that description. I greatly appreciate it, man. Here we go. Let us be lovers, we'll marry our fortunes together I've got some real estate here in my bag So we bought a pack of cigarettes And Mrs. Wagner pies And we walked off to look for America I said as we boarded a Greyhound in Pittsburgh Michigan seems like a dream to me now It took me four days to hitchhike from Saginaw And I've come to look for a man With the face hands She said the man in the gabardine suit was a spy I said be careful his bow tie is really a camera Toss me a cigarette I think there's one in my raincoat Ah, oh, we smoked the last one an hour ago So I looked at the scenery She read her magazines And the moon rose over Though I knew she was sleeping I'm empty, I'm making And I don't know why Counting the cars On the New Jersey Turnpike They've all come To look for America All come to look for
playing throughout that, man. Perfect playing throughout that. I'm sitting in the railway station, got a ticket for my destination. Okay, I don't know if we're clicking into the next song or getting into it. I'll, I'll resume it from right there. Um, but America, real quick, I don't know if that's a song about, like, I thought it was going to be about immigration to America. Uh, there's some definitely big stories throughout history about that and people being able to get here and live the American dream. But I also felt he said they were boarding the bus in Pittsburgh, the Greyhound in Pittsburgh. So it made me think, well, these are people here already, but maybe they're trying to find their American dream, their place where they belong, where they could plant roots. Maybe uh, they, they want to transplant. They don't feel uh, pro right where they're at. They don't feel engaged. They don't feel like that's community to them. But I don't know. Let's go ahead and start it back a little bit. This station got a ticket for my destination. Mm hmm on a tour of one night stands my suitcase and guitar in hand and every stop is neatly planned for a poet and a one man band homeward bound i wish i was homeward bound home where my thoughts escaping home where my music's playing home where my love lies waiting silently for me every day is an endless stream cigarettes and magazines mm -hmm. and each town looks the same to me the movies and the factories and every stranger's face I see Reminds me that I long to be homeward bound Oh, and I wish I was homeward bound All's playing though Home where my thoughts are skipping Home where my music's playing Home where my love lies waiting silent Tonight I'll sing my songs again, I'll play the game and pretend mm -hmm. But all my words come back to me in shades of mediocrity Like emptiness in harmony, I need someone to comfort me I really like the way the two songs kind of meld together with meaning where the first one's hitting the road, starting your journey out there to look for where you belong. The second one is being out on the road, but longing for where you left, right? So they're like, they're very, uh, it's like a mirror image of, well, not a mirror image, but it's like, you know what I'm saying? They, they've got a connection. They've got a connection in that way, uh, but they're quite opposite uh at, at the same time so i thought that was great man america like i said we'll dive in a little bit and check it out i don't want to make the video too too long for you guys but like i said america to me it sounded like going out and trying to find that american dream trying to find where you can plant your roots where you can start your own um homeward bound gave me some vibes uh similar to when we checked out it was a uh, Jackson Brown, the loadout stay, but the loadout part where he's talking about all this, all the towns kind of look the same. They feel the same. Uh, he's saying that too. He's a traveling one man band, poet, artist going out to try to make some money, make a name for himself. But at the same time, um, he's longing for where he left and everything just looks the same to him. It feels the same to him. And the one place where he can get color back in his life is back where he was. Uh, but this is him trying to also 
uh, make an income for himself, earning some cash, right? Um, but longing to be where he was at. And anyone that's had to travel might feel the same about that, man. When you're out, gone, yeah, you may be doing uh, things that are fun, great, having a, a different kind of time, uh, or in this case, trying to make it for yourself, but you're longing for what's back at, at home, you know, your spouse, your kids, your family, your friends, man. Um, that's one thing I constantly thought about when I was on deployment, and I was always like, man, I can't wait to go have a beer with my brother. I was thinking in my head, night after night, there I am working you know, when you're when you're on deployment, man, I mean, you're working all the time, right? It's like you don't get time to go out uh, too often and just like relax. I mean, it's like, you know, there were a lot of times where I had 12 hours on, 12 hours off. So I worked for 12 hours straight. Then I had 12 hours straight. Well, eight of that 12 hours is sleeping. So I really might have four hours to do whatever I was doing, studying, um, you know, watch it, watch a, a movie or uh, you got to get eating in there so really i mean when you're gone man it's work 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 and a lot of times i was just like man i could imagine right now maybe my brother and my friends are having some drinks together having listened to some music having some good times and i'm just working 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 i can't wait till i get home and i can pop a cold one with the boys you know so uh, i get it man i get this song all right so we're gonna try to learn quickly about this one this is america from simon and garfunkel released in 1968 it says the song was written and composed by paul simon and concerns young lovers hitchhiking their way across the united states in search for america in both literal and figurative sense uh it was inspired by a 1964 road trip that simon took with his then girlfriend kathy chitty uh the song has been regarded as one of simon's strongest songwriting efforts and one of the duo's best songs of 20 uh best songs uh, 2014 rolling stones reader poll ranked it the group's fourth best-selling song america was inspired by a five-day road excursion simon undertook in september 1964 with chitty producer tom wilson had called simon living in london at the time back to the united states to finalize mixes and artwork for the debut studio album simon reluctant to leave chitty invited her to come with him they spent five days driving the country together so that's how we got that one man right there that song so that's what it's about two young lovers out there really trying to find their place in america discovering having experiences within the land within the borders man so let's see what else we got all right, right here we got Homeward Bound, released in 1966. This one also written by Paul Simon, okay? It says, um, Simon wrote the song during his time in England, possibly while waiting for a train at Witness Railway Station in northwest of England. It says, during his time in England, Simon met Kathy Chitty, who was working as a ticket taker at the club. The two hit it off instantly, but it became clear that Simon desired to perform in London, resulting in an emotional farewell. Following a performance at Witness, uh, Simon was dropped off at Witness Railway Station for a train to his next gig in Humberside. He had been missing Chitty, and he began to write Homeward Bound on a scrap of paper. A plaque commemorating the song is displayed in that station. So that's pretty cool. And there's the plaque right there, man. Uh, at Witness Station in 1965, Paul Simon wrote the song Homeward Bound. Dude, that is dope. That's dope stuff that they could even catch on to this and uh, put a plaque there. They, they are aware of the significance of that moment, and they have something to commemorate it and honor it. So, or honor it. Well, thank you for this donation request. I appreciate Appreciate it, man. Like learning a little bit about the history on that one. And we pretty much got it right. You know, give or take. We pretty much got it right on what they were talking about. So thanks. I hope you guys enjoyed rocking out with me here with Simon and Garfunkel. There's more coming, so stay tuned on that, man. Thank you guys so much. Have a great one. If there's more from Simon and Garfunkel that you guys want to see on the channel, just let me know. Comment down below, man. More songs that I need to get to from them. Don't forget to like, subscribe, check out the description. If you enjoy the channel and myself, please consider becoming a member here on my YouTube or Patreon for as little as three bucks, man. Thank you guys so much for rocking with me here today, and I'll see you on the next one, man. Peace.